गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स इन मॉड्यूल नंबर थ्री ऑफ लेसन नंबर फिफ्टीन बायोडाइवर्सिटी एंड कंजर्वेशन ऑफ बायोलॉजी वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट बायोलॉजिकल हॉट स्पॉट्स बिकॉज इट इज क्वाइट इम्पॉसिबल टू कंजर्व कंप्लीट बायोडाइवर्सिटी एज ए होल सो वट वी हैव टू डू वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट सर्टन बायोलॉजिकल हॉट स्पॉट्स दीज बायोलॉजिकल हॉट स्पॉट्स आर दोज एरिया ऑफ लैंड which are very much rich in biodiversity that's why they are considered as biological hot spots so biological hot spots are natural environment with high biodiversity and endemic species among 34 hot spots of world the two biodiversity hot spot of india are western ghats and eastern himalayas means throughout the world ecologist identify 34 hot spots to be preserved so that a large number of endangered species should be conserved only by conserving these biological hot spots now we are going to uh, discuss here about different type of species threatened species the species whose population number is decreasing and likely to decrease more in future is called threatened species iucn international union for conservation of nature and natural resources red data book the book maintained by iucn in which threatened species are recorded is called red data book mab men and biodiversity program wwf the world wildlife fund for nature ib wl indian board for wildlife ibb international biological program undp united nation development program major categories of threatened species extinct species the species that completely disappeared from earth they are called extinct species while on the other hand endangered species those species whose population is drastically reduced and are in danger of extinction if they are not going to be conserved such type of species they are called endangered species for example asiatic lion one horned rhinoceros lion tailed macaw and nilgiri thar they are is in the category of endangered species the another type that is of vulnerable species the species that likely enters the endangered category are called vulnerable species for example wild goat wild yak barasinga wild ass etc the fourth form is rare species the species with small population which are neither endangered nor vulnerable are called rare species means their number of organism within the population always remains very less so they are neither in the category of endangered or nor in the category of vulnerable species thank you